So, um, let's say uh, you want to uh, make a 2D uh, type game. So the basic um, easiest way of setting that up is to add a tag on the kind of plane on the level you want everything to be at. Um, and we'll just call that plane. And then you get a um, get your puppet, and then to the puppet you can add a follower. A follower kind of drags objects towards uh, a position, basically, and you can give it a tag name like plane, so that it it moves towards that. So if I put play time now, oh, we need it. We need to give it some more strength and stuff that'll do so it'll move towards that um that tag and i used uh up and down on here to cycle through the tags in the scene so we don't want to be just stuck on that tag forever um but we would just want it to be st stuck uh on this kind of line like that that the, ta the tag is defining so then we can um turn down so uh, this is the z-axis going that way, that way, and the x-axis is going that that way, and then the y-axis is going like that way. So we only want it to affect the puppet on this direction. So then we can turn the other ones down. So we don't want it to affect x or y, and we don't want it to dampen x or y or the direction. So now, if I like move that over there and then look at this line here it pulls it to the right spot but we're still able to move so if I go like that I'm still able to move around like that um, and then normally you'd have a ca uh, camera pointer I'll just press triangle on it to snap it to the grid um, yeah so then now I can move like left and right and I can jump but I'm always stuck to that plane, which is what we want. I'd like to give a big thank you to my supporters who made this tutorial possible. Jack Power, Hyper Dream Surfer, Martinity DK, X Cantaloupe, Rev Player, and MDKD99. Thanks everyone. Thanks for watching. If you'd like me to continue making these daily tutorials and helping creators across the internet, you can support me through the link in the description. Thanks for your consideration, and I'll see you in the next one.